We hope you like really, really new music because we have some premieres tonight, some pieces that have never been heard before and will never be heard again. <laughs> Maybe for good reason. But uh, I played in the symphony orchestra for too long a time. Lots of years, lost most of my hearing from the trumpets. But, you know, you carry on best you can. And uh, it's, uh, it's wonderful and stressful and stressful and wonderful and really stressful sometimes. So I decided when I left the orchestra and started a new career teaching at the University of Iowa, that I would, uh, it was about time to have some fun. I know you're not supposed to have fun when you play music. Music is serious, so okay, I got it. But I decided it's time to have some fun, and what that means is that I get to pick the notes for a change. Not Schubert, not anybody else, just me. I get to pick the notes. And then I met this amazing man over here, and I found out he does the same thing, and then we got together and we have had a couple of really interesting musical conversations together. I don't think we played together for, what, two years? So the, whatever you hear now is the first time we played together in two years or whatever it is. But it doesn't matter. We're just having some interesting conversations. But we need your help on this. So um, I have some basic ideas about what we might do here. And then I need your suggestions. So for the pe first piece, I know this is a very well-educated audience. So I want you to think of a word beginning with a letter of the alphabet. No, wait a minute. Uh, <laughs> let me narrow that down a little bit. Um, I need an, some kind of interesting, flamboyant, wild and crazy adjective. Adjective. Just shout it out when, you get, when it comes to you. Now, not in the middle of the night, right now. Chaotic. Chaotic. Oh, wonderful one. Excellent. Now I need the name of some kind of interesting, wild and crazy animal. What? I have bad hearing, you've got to say it loud. Zebra. Zebra, okay. The first piece is the chaotic zebra. <laughs> syllables really loud. David Fitzrandolph. David Fitzrandolph, is that right? Okay, now uh, we are going to borrow the rhythm of your name and make a piece with it. Um, this is no reflection on you except <laughs> accidentally. Thank you. 
is, as I recall, May 2nd, is that right? I would like to, we would like to make up a piece now that uh, some holiday music for a holiday or an event or something that's gotten too little attention. You know, there's Christmas carols and scary music for Halloween and everything else. Can you think of some, something that deserves its music which has never gotten any attention? Labor Day. What? Labor Day. Day. <laughs> there's no labor carols? Okay. Uh, maybe that was, that's so yesterday. Um, Fourth of July. Fourth of July has patriotic music. We want to serve an underserved um, uh, event or something. That Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo. Oh man. <laughs> We just had the Chicoria was really Cinco de Mayo-ish, so I don't know. We, I think that was served pretty well. Something unusual, I think, you know, like National Scurvy Awareness Day or something. Like Groundhog Day. Groundhog Day. Hmm. Siblings Day. What? Siblings Day. Siblings Day? Well, that's the actual day today, isn't it? Oh, my goodness. We're about to have a fight or something. <laughs> All right, Siblings Day. Ready? <laughs> A Siblings Day Carol.
so you can see after a hard day at the orchestra. It's fun to come home and be crazy. We have one more piece we'd like to do for you. All this is new, new to uh, Mariner. He's never, he has no idea what, what I'm telling you here. We have one more piece, but we need your help on this, and that is we'd like to create a film score. Uh, so first, I need a genre, a kind of film genre. What? Sci-fi. Sci-fi, excellent choice. Now we need the name of a sci-fi, fictitious sci-fi movie. Um, the floor is open. Title. The floor is open. <laughs> the flora is open. The attack of the wild chrysanthemums. From outer space. <laughs> Thank you. 